Bismillahirrahmanirrahim. Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. And good morning, student. And come back with me again, Ustaz Subri as your English teacher. I hope all of you will find great, excellent, and amazing. Semoga hari ini semuanya dalam keadaan baik dan selalu mendapatkan lindungan dari Allah Subhanahu wa Ta'ala. Before we start our lesson, let's reciting Basmalah together. Bismillahirrahmanirrahim. Okay, this is English lesson for 8th grade. And this is 15 week, minggu. And we learn about how to invite someone directly and how to restore the invitation. For example, will you come to my party? Yes. You can answer it by accepting or refusing. Misalnya, kalau accepting, cool, I can wait for the day to come. Atau cool, I can wait for joining your party. Itu kalau menerima. How about refusing? Refusing, bisa bilang gini. I'd like to, but I can't. I have to see a doctor. Nah, dia tuh harus ke, pergi ke dokter. And invitation sambal yang lain, misalnya. Do you want to go to books books bookstore with me after school? Mau nggak sih kamu pergi ke toko buku atau gramet lah ya? Denganku setelah sekolah selesai. You can. Accept or reviews. Kalau accept, accepting itu bisa pakai salah satu dari delapan ini. Misalnya, great idea. Misalnya, itu accepting. Or refusing. Thanks, but I'm afraid I can't. Atau, thanks, but I'm afraid I cannot. Yeah. Itu contoh invitation someone mengajak seseorang atau mengundang. Hmm, itu yang ini ya. How about the formal way? The formal way itu menggunakan would di depannya. Misalnya, would you like to come over for lunch tomorrow? Nah, dia itu ngajak untuk lunch, makan siang besok. Tapi, you can say it you accept it by using yes that would be nice or okay i will come atau okay i will join of course i will come nah, itu salah satu accepting or you can reviewing by saying i will i wish i could but i'm a bit busy these days nah, dia tuh pengen sebenarnya cuman dia tuh lagi uh, sibuk beberapa hari ini nah, itu reviewing itu do you understand what I'm saying student if yes say in comment in this video nah, terus we are in a digital era And tadi kan misalnya kalau mau invite by uh, direct way, misalnya ketemu face to face. Nah, how about how to invite someone by phone or by WhatsApp or by text dan lain-lainnya. Nah, ini sering banget nih. Tinggal buka HP, buka WhatsApp, and then call your uh, person that you might to invite misalnya Sasha hello can I talk to Lucas Lucas said hello this is Lucas speaking who is this Sasha replied hi Lucas this is Sasha do you have any plan this Sunday Lucas said hi Sasha nothing planned why Sasha replied good Would you like 
to join a housewarming party. Look at it. She moved. I'd love to. Message me the address and the time, please. Sasha said yes. She got new apartment. Sure. See you. Okay. See you then. Hmm. That is uh, the invitation by using phone. And my question is, what sentence that indicate Sasha invite Lucas? And how about the Lucas response? He will join it. Or he reviews it. You can message your ustad or ustaza, or you can comment in the column description di di komennya di bagian komennya. Kalau usta kalau akhwat kirimnya ke akhwat kalau by using WhatsApp atau kalau nggak pengen WhatsApp langsung komen di videonya kalau Ikhwan langsung WA ke saya don't cross the line oke okay? next write a simple invitation letter nah ini menulis invitation letter yang sederhana to Siska today I have just moved in the neighborhood I would like to invite you to dinner on Sunday, 25 October 2020 at 3 p.m. The address is Jalan Anggrek, 32 Bandung. Hoping to meet you at new at my new house from Ria. P.S. Please let me know if you can come. Message on me, 089xxxx blah blah blah. That is the simple invitation letter uh, that written by Ria. Nah, Ria mengundang Siska untuk uh, dinner di hari Minggu, tanggal 25 Oktober, jam 3 p.m. Alamatnya di Jalan Anggrek, 32 Bandung. Nah, ini that's the important things. BS, BS itu istilah konfirmasi jika datang atau enggak. If you get uh, the invitation letter and in this letter it has BS, you have to respond it while you accept it or you review it. Jangan membuat orang menunggu. Yes, that's important thing. Nah, asking and giving permission. Asking permission. Uh, permission is the act allow someone to do something or an authori authorization or an approval or a consent of something to be done. Izin istilahnya. Misalnya, can I have the juice? I'm thirsty. Boleh nggak sih aku mesen jus atau aku uh, beli jus misalnya? Saya haus. Nah, giving granting permission. Sure, here you are. Nah, atau not giving permission. Sorry, but there is only one left. Nah, itu ditandai dengan modal. Can, my, my juga, could, nah, dan lain-lainnya. Giving granting juga bisa... Uh, selalu yes sure yes okay all right but not giving granting atau granting permission sorry and sorry dan lain-lain that's the rest uh, the granting permission okay thank you very much ah this is the next quotes it is a slower process but Uh, I'm gonna speed it up. Yeah, I can write. Eh, no, I can uh, read 
um, Latin words and it's not my style. But thank you so much this uh, PowerPoint. Thank you so much, Staza. You made a great pro uh, PowerPoint, and I hope all of you uh, get some knowledge or horizon. We close our meeting by resetting Hamdalah together. Alhamdulillah, Hirabil Alamin. And adios, ya Carmelos. Goodbye. Wassalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. And we will come. Uh, we will meet again next meeting. See ya.